Hello everybody, my name is Charlie and uh, I'm going to teach you how to export your Final Cut sequences faster than Final Cut can or compressor can. Um, it's very easy, you need to download MPEG Stream Clip, which is a free program. The link is in the down bar. Um, and it's very, very easy. First, you start by going to your sequence and um, you want to set your in and out points. So I want my in to start here, and I'm just going to hit I on the keyboard. So I. Okay, so I'm going to set, set my out point, which is O on the keyboard. And you can see right here is the out. Then what you want to do is export the sequence by hitting Command, which is Apple, E to export. And this window should pop up. You want to make sure that your settings are set to current settings. Don't change that. Include audio and video. Markers none. And usually this will be checked. You do not want this checked. You do not want the movie self-contained. Okay. So then you're going to mm, save it to... I'm going to save it to my export folder. Just hit save. And... It should export in no time. Okay, next step. You want to go to your um, non-self-contained file that you made. So I'm going to go to my project files. And what you want to do is take your non-contained um, movie, drag it down into MPEG Stream Clip, If you don't have it in your dock, you can just right click and open with MPEG Stream Clip. It's down here. Okay, so when it's an MPEG Stream Clip, here's what you're going to do. You're going to go to File, and you're going to Export as MPEG 4. Click that. Now, I don't know why the quality is always set at 50 for the default, but you should move it to 100. Um, you don't have to limit your data rate. If you shot an HD footage, keep it at an HD setting, so 1920 by 1080. Uh, you don't want interlaced scaling. Make sure that your audio settings are good right over here. Okay, looks all good. Okay, so I'm going to save it uh, back in my destination. Hit save. Now, for whatever reason, MPEG exports at a very fast speed. Um, right now we're going to about 25 megabits per second. That's fantastic. Much faster than compressor. Uh, and I think just much easier in general. You have more settings control. This documentary is about five and a half minutes long and it would take me about six minutes an MPEG stream clip to export, but about a half hour in Final Cut, and I'm using an i i7 uh, quad core iMac. If this tutorial helped you, please don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and check out this week's upcoming episode of why your DSLR footage looks like crap. I'll be going over all of the settings you need to know to get great, gorgeous, sexy looking film. Check it out. I'm Charlie Schaefer. Stay classy. Here. Uh, so I was playing Black Ops this weekend, and I came across this weird glitch. So what? You're a little different. Yeah, different. I really want my ideas to change the world, but it's a little intimidating.